Right, it's Phil again with another bit of a mystery project, this one. The mystery is that I've no idea what you could use it for. Um, basically, it's a blob in a servo lead, much like any of the other projects. This particular blob has a uh, push button and an LED, and uh, this is what it does. Right, we've got the servo tester just generating uh, servo signals now. And if I press this button, I can move the servo around, let go, and it remembers whatever I did, repeats it over and over again. It's like a movement memory. All the time it's playing, the green LED is flashing away quite quickly. If I want to record something different, so I can put this up to, say, 2000, start recording, slowly bring it down to 1000. There we go, this is the, the count slowly coming down to 1000. Back up to two again, slowly back down to a thousand. Ignore the numbers on there, that's just supplying power. That power can be a battery. There you go, it's just the battery and the recorder and the servo. It'll record a maximum of only ten seconds. The pick chip's not got an awful lot of memory. And um, it's only using every alternate frame as it stands to get ten seconds out of it. But with ten seconds you can do a bit. Let's do something else. Yeah. Let's give it something a bit more complicated to do. So press the button, it starts flashing slowly. Left, 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 right, right, right. Left, 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 right, right, right. And again, no, nothing to do with the servo tester. And plug the battery in. Left, 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 right, right, right. And it just follows basically what I did on the uh, on the servo test there. And it will go quite slowly. If the memory fills, then the LED that's flashing now will stay on. So that's full now. No point doing any more because it's just remembered as much as it can and that's how much it will play back. So regardless of what I do now, that's not being recorded anymore. As soon as I let go, it will start to be played. And this is what I was doing with the knob before the uh, memory filled up. So there you go. Uh, servo movement memory. I have absolutely no idea what this could be used for. The only one thing I can think of is maybe um, Richard's pilots with the animated uh, pilots. That's the only thing I can think of. Or maybe someone pilot waving his hand or doing a low inverted pass flicking the V's, I don't know. There you go anyway. Cheers for now, bye bye.